I know Mark Haka for a very long time. I worked with him. I stayed with him. When we got expelled from the ANC, I gave him shelter in my own home in Polokwane when they wanted to kill him. I would have saved his life. I had a duty to save his life. To a municipal manager, and say to a municipal manager, you are going to fill this tender document for me. I do not have a tax clearance, and you are going to give me that tender of building the road, and it will happen. Because if the municipal manager wouldn't do that, then they are going to kill that municipal manager. Those are the things that Makaka was fighting against in that rotten municipality, in that rotten province of uh, the ANC. I told him many times to leave the ANC, to come and be the national organizer of the EFF because I knew he loved the ground. I knew he loved working with ordinary people on the ground. I also found a safe house for him in Johannesburg. The car Magaka was driving, we bought that car for him. So, and uh, even when he was shot, uh, I spoke to his wife, I spoke to the family members. Before Magaka was shot, I had a lot of meetings with him, discussing whether uh, he's still interested to pursue the struggle for economic emancipation and which other roles can he play in pursuit of the struggle for economic emancipation.